everyone. Tonight I have the sparkly lemon. Yes, I said lemon bath bomb from Unique Commodities. And um, for some reason, I forgot the actual name of this. Um, but she made it because she and I were talking about lemon bath bombs. And so here we have it. I'll have to give you the name of it um, in the description because I got so excited that I just ripped the name of it off of, I'm sorry, the uh, wrapping off of it. And yeah, I don't know what the heck I did with the wrapping. All right, guys, so here we go with Unique Commodities and this sparkling, delicious, lemony smelling bath bomb. waiting for lemon for so long. I was told by one bath bomb maker that, I'm sorry, I just got overwhelmed with the delicious scent of lemon. <laughs> um, but I was told by one bath bomb maker that um, she was told that people were getting tired of lemon scented bath bombs, so that's why she stopped making them. Um, must have been before I started shopping indie shops because I hadn't found any at um, Lush, all the years I had been shopping at Lush, and there have been a lot of years I was shopping at Lush. I am an old, 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 been shopping at Lush for a long time, chick, and I never found a true lemon scent um, at Lush, unless my local Lush just wasn't selling it. But in any event, here we have a true, true lemon scented bath bomb, not mixed with anything else just lemon so I see a lot of other um, bath bombs that say mixed with lemon this and that whatever whatever I just wanted the pure scent of lemon and here we have it it smells beautiful and clean and almost tart you know just like a lemon slice that's what it smells like and this foam is working it as well. So there's shimmer everywhere. The water is turning a nice lemon color. And I'm just super, super happy that Unique Commodities um, made this. And all I had to do was say the word and she made it happen. And I have nothing more to say because it is super sparkly. Look at that. And it's just pure, clean lemon. Nothing more. Nothing less. does look like there's some pink coming out of it, which I didn't expect, and it's super pretty. She warned me it wouldn't float, so I'm trying to, um, Hold it in a way that it'll flow, but I think I may be blocking one of the stripes of the pink. I have to stop and take a picture. Looks like I'm having a hard time holding on to it. And we have floatage and also spillage at the same time. So when it finally started floating, it uh, actually got overtaken as well. So very, very soft bath bomb, by the way. I could feel it in my hand that it was going to be a super soft crush. 
smells so super amazing in here. And I'm very thankful that at least somebody decided, yes, I can make, oh my gosh, that soft crush. I can make that bath bomb for you, Ingrid. All you have to do is ask. Now, because it was so super shimmery on the outside, I am absolutely positive that this water is going to be super shimmery, but I have these pretty little stripes out here and I really don't want to destripe the water. But let's go on and take a look. But look at these stripes out here too. As you can see, all the pretty striping, the gold in it, um, interwoven with the colors. Very pretty. Great job, Taronda. You're just amazing. So let's see. Oh! Look at that sparkle. You're killing it, girl. There is just ridiculous amounts of sparkle in this tub. So I'm going to have to get in here and test out this lemony sensation for myself. Tons and tons of sparkle. And lemon. Who could ask for more? My mom would have loved this. She loved her lemon scents. Look at that. Alright guys. There's Toronto's lemon bomb and I forgot again the name of it, but it is if you like lemon, as I do. This is one super shimmery, super just clean, clean lemon scented bath bomb. Really worth your money. All right, guys, talk to you on the next one. Oh my gosh, the shimmery is beautiful. All right, bye.